chameleons. Today, let's learn about opposites. We also call them antonyms. Opposites are words that directly contrast with each other. That might sound difficult to understand, so let me show you. Let's do an activity here. The first picture is day. Day directly contrasts with night. So let's match that. Day and night. They are opposites. What about asleep? Asleep directly contrasts with awake. They are opposites. Asleep and awake are opposites, chameleons. Okay, next one. The picture is hard. That's a rock and it's very hard. Hard directly contrasts with soft, just like this pillow. So let's match it. Hard and soft are opposites. Okay, it's your turn, chameleons. Can you match the word full? What is the opposite of full? Full directly contrasts with hungry. Full and hungry are opposites. Good job, chameleons. Let's try one more. How about fast? Fast directly contrasts with slow, just like this turtle. Let's match it. Fast and slow are opposites. Let's try one more activity, chameleons. Look here. The first picture is full. Do you see the glass? It's full of water. Full directly contrasts with empty. Full and empty are opposites. I'm really having fun with you, chameleons. Let's try some more. What is the opposite of go? Go directly contrasts with stop. Go and stop are opposites. Very good. Okay, look at this cute little back of an elephant. The back of an elephant contrasts with front. Back and front are opposites. We're almost done. How about big? This big ball directly contrasts with a small ball. Let's match it. Big and small are opposites. Last one. Look at this pretty girl. Girl directly contrasts with boy. Just like this picture. Girl and boy are opposites, chameleons. Very good. I had so much fun with you. There you have it. We've learned about opposites. See you again next time.